Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. In this video I'm going to show you how to get update 15.1 for your iPhone. I should say the iOS update for your iPhone. Now, here's the crazy thing about this. If you go into general, there is no indication that there is an update. So if I turn this way here and I click 15.1. Okay, so I, I'll turn it back this way so... No, I don't need to. Okay. So here what it says is iOS 15.1 at SharePlay. Entirely new way to share an experience with family, friends, and FaceTime. This release also adds the ability to capture ProRes using the iPhone 13 Pro and iPhone 13 Pro Max, as well as verifiable COVID-19 vaccination cards in Apple Wallet. So basically what that means is you could have your vaccination card in your Apple Wallet. It includes bugs and fixes for your iPhone and if you want to learn more you can go uh, to this website and you can get uh, certain things alright so I'm gonna download it now and we are going to install it So here's a cool thing. You can use the cellular data to do the update, which will take forever. Or you could use Wi-Fi and not have it take as long. So I have Wi-Fi turned on on my phone, so I'm going to click Do Not Use Cellular Data. So just like last time, this is going to take a little bit. Now... What's nice about this is it's not taking as long. Five minutes is good. When I updated to 15.0.2, it took a lot longer. Now, having certain things in your Apple Wallet is good, and let me explain why. These days, with certain things going on and certain cities requiring certain things, having it in your wallet is good, your Apple Wallet is good, because all you have to do is just click your Apple Wallet and it'll be in there. So this is a good thing that you're able to do the certain thing. Now this may take a little longer than usual, or it may not, so. But the nice thing is, is I already have iOS 15.02. This is 15.1 that we are going to.
And yes, just like last time, it is going to prepare it. Preparing it is going to take the most amount of time. So what's going to happen, this is just like any other update. As you can see, it is preparing the update. as you can see there. All right, so it's downloaded. Now it's going to ask me to install it. So I'm going to change the camera angle here and I'm going to 
install it that way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the phone on the ground there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the phone this way again. And now I'm going to click install. It's going to verify the update just like before. And then what's going to happen is you're going to see the Apple logo. And what's going to happen is just like last time, it's going to update. You can see the um, progress bar right now. And just like last time, it's going to restart once or twice, and then it'll go.
and now we'll restart it. And now it's going to continue the other half of the update. general here. So if I go to about, we are at 15.1. I'm in California, so that's why it's just California. It's a little bit different. We go to general. So now if I click software update, we are up to date. So anyway, with that said, that is it for this video. Please comment, like, subscribe, and click that bell for more notifications.